let's remove the action from the KRG whiskey chassis. Two screws, very simple. Simple pair of viola. Let's remove the scope. Alder Adversus mount made in Italy. Two very nice guys. Valentin and Andrea are behind this very beautiful company. I must go to San Marino the factory one day. Well, I hope I could visit with my son in the factory and drink a couple of Scope is zero compromise optic CZ 840. And now I'm going to put the old barrel into the barrel wise. And here you can see, you can see this marking, it's where the head, head space is the correct position. You can only Remove the barrel and you can easily get not a new one. You don't need go go and no go gauge, only twist the barrel with the right mark marking. You saw it. Yes. And now we can take the big monkey branch. And you can see I just easily move it. It doesn't need a lot of force to do it now. And of course, the chamber is empty. Never, never. Now let's remove the cover. Just take it off and next win. Next one is Ensio Fidamos Chambered 260 Remington 28 inch shank. Very beefy, beefy one. I got here also the same same marking as you can see in the in these two barrels. These markings are when the headspace is correct, so you only, only put action on the marking and the job is done. You almost get it with bare hands, but nice to have that. And that is, that's done. I'll only take the 
action on the barrel of the vise and the barrel and now just put it back to the garage chassis. I left left this hex bit in the, the mounting screw because if if it's gonna drop off you have to lose it to and it's make a little bit more work to do but if we can if we can just do it like this so Always use torque wrench if you have KRG, KRG and Tikka. The right moment is 7.3 newton meters. I think it was 70 or 68 inch pound in American measure. There we have power swap. It did not take many minutes. 